afternoon, ma'am, sir. I am R.C. Narada, a teacher one of the God from San Isidro District. And here is my lesson plan for junior high school teaching demonstration. Okay. Okay, let me start my class proper. Everybody stand up and let us pray in the name of the Father, of the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good afternoon, class. So, how are you today? So, you say, since we're okay, we're all fine. Let me check your attendance first. If your name is Paul, please raise your right hand and say, present. Okay. Anchola Emmanuel, present. Zamora Ellen, present. Since we're all present today, let's give ourselves a round of applause. Okay, what did we discuss yesterday class? Yes, Mary Ann? Okay, very good. We discussed about food chain and food web. What is food chain class? Okay, yes, Phil? Very good. Food chain is, an, uh, is a simplest uh, food arrangement, uh, feeding arrangement of an ecosystem. Well, food web class is an interconnected food arrangement in an ecosystem. Why is it class? that we need to know or understand the relationship of food chain and food web in food pyramid. Anyone? Yes, Angelica? Okay, thank you. Very good. So, the arrows of the food chain or food web, uh, food web class is that it represents the flow of energy. It shows or allows us to know the direction of energy as it is transferred from organism to another. So here class is our uh, I have here class the 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 picture of the example of the food web. So the uh, from this food web class who can construct a uh, food pyramid? Yes or in okay let uh, uh let me uh yeah Okay, hey, very good. Thank you, Arlene. So, here are the possible answers given from the given food web. So, this is the example of food pyramid. So, grass or what color will be eaten by the rabbit, and rabbit will be eaten by the snake, and snake will be eaten by the hole. From this, uh, uh, from this teacher class or activity, what do you think is our topic for today? Yes, John? Okay, very good. Our topic for today is all about food pyramid. So, uh, and you, and from, at the end of this lesson class, you should learn or you should be able to learn these uh, this following objectives. Please read everyone our objectives for today. Okay, thank you, class. Okay, let me ask you first. Can we do all these? Uh, uh, can we do all these things? Okay, now let's go down to another to our next activity. So, plus, this is our night questions, and I will only give you uh, I will only give you ten minutes to answer this new activity. And this is our criteria for our activity today. Okay, please read everyone. Okay, thank you, class. So. Go to your respective groups and form a circle and read silently. Uh, answer silently. Okay, time is up. Are you done, class? Okay, since you're all done, uh, reporters must present their reports. Okay, let's give uh, five class to each reporters. Okay, let's answer your activity. Which group of organism has the greatest by mass and energy? Your answers are all correct. The producers are the plants. Next question: Which group of organisms has the least biomass and energy? Okay, your answers are all correct. So the human has the least biomass and energy. Okay, next question: What happens to the amount of biomass from the bottom to the top of the pyramid? Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, your the answer is the well, the amount of biomass from the bottom to the top of the pyramid is the so let me give your points, class. For group one, I will give five points for the teamwork. 
but who could will only give three points because some of members did not participate. For who clear will give them four points because not all them, not all members participated. Next for the presentation, since all the group uh, reporters did their work, uh, well, so I will all I will give my points to each group. Okay, for the timeliness, group one is late two or three. Two minutes is late, so I will only give them three points. But the two, they are on time, so I will give them five points. Well, the two three, they are one minute late, so I will give them four points. Total, uh, eight plus five is thirteen. Thirteen and thirteen, so you got all the uh, so the uh, so for all you got thirteen points. Okay, the pyramid of energy is a pyramid of biomass. The, the biomass, the biomass is the total mass of organism in a food chain or food web. Food pyramid class is the <clears throat> correct, uh, correct uh, form of or the correct or the the right way to know the the flow of energy. So here, class, based on this figure, uh, the plant or the first profit level is the plants. They are the producers. They've got the 100% of energy. Well, the chicken here, class, is the second profit level. They are the first primary consumers. So they only got 500 grams, 500 grams of energy. Well, the humans, human here who eats the chicken, does only got only 50 grams. So this human here is has the least or uh, least body mass and energy, and then also the last consumer or the third consumer, uh, consumer or the second consumer and the uh, the least uh they got the least energy of uh, at least energy. So here class as as human, what did you observe of the food pyramid? Yes, John. Okay, very good. See, you are a keen observer. So in the in the food pyramid class, uh, the energy levels that is increasing from the bottom to the top. So all uh, why, uh, why do you, uh, what do you think? Uh, why is it what do you think is the reason why only uh, why is it is decreasing? Yes, Janine, very good. Okay, Janine. Um very good, thank you. So um uh, they got okay ninety percent of the energy of the producers or of the producers. It, it is used by the last processes. Well, the ten percent will be be used by the consumers. So that is why only ten percent will be given to the each consumers. Okay. Anyone? Any clarification? Okay. Since we're at, so next let's proceed to the next activity. Remain in your group or in your group. So. Uh, this are the right question. So time is up. Are you done, class? Okay, reporters must present. Okay, thank you, class, for the present course. Okay, I will give five points to each group for the presentation. The timeliness is one. I will give only four points. Group two, I will give five points, and I will give three points to group three. While the teamwork, I will give all five points. Because all of you did, did a great work. So 14, 15, and 13. So that is your score for this activity class. So here it is. I have uh, another example of the theory. Based on this picture class, uh, what uh, who can construct a good pyramid? Okay, yes, Leo. Okay, thank you, Leo. Very good. So these are the example, another example of the pyramid. Okay, see, uh, are you done? Uh, any clarification class? Since uh, any clarification, questions, violent reactions? Okay, since for that, uh, let's proceed to our next activity, activity which is evaluation. So, I will only give you five, uh, five minutes to uh, prepare one more sheet of paper and answer these following questions. My time is up. Let's check your papers. Okay, exchange paper to your seatmate class. Okay, these are the answers. Okay, since we're done, go back to your proper seats, arrange your chairs, and uh, pick your trashes. Okay, since we're done, uh, since we're done, let's end our class with a prayer. Everybody stand up. 
Amen. Goodbye and thank you, class.